everybody! Welcome to Ask Anything Wednesday and today is a very special edition of Ask Anything Wednesday because I'm here with my friend and special guest, Haley Kyra. Hi guys! Haley is from May Movement and I'm gonna let her tell you a little bit more about what May Movement is. We believe that everybody has their own movement in life and I know for Steph, it's definitely reaching other people's goals, helping them with their health goals. And for me, I love health and fitness too, but so many people have other interests, you know, like charitable outreach and music and dance and things like that. So we just want to motivate you to do your own movement so that you can go out and motivate other people. And we do that through our videos, we have different products that we're coming out with, and this is one of our, our ways that we like to reach people. I just, uh, I've seriously been inspired by Haley's story. So I really like we met and well actually today is the first this day we're the first meeting. day we've met. <laughs> so it's like we're me for me it's like I'm meeting a best friend. Exactly. It's we got a lot in common and we really feel together that inspiring other women to just go after what they dream of and what they want is a good a good path to follow. We say yes. Yes. And look what awesome. I got too. Oh yeah, Steph's rocking her main movement bracelet, so we're between these today. Uh-huh. And I'll have links in the down bar where you guys can get your own. And we'll have a special announcement in another video, right? Well. Cool. About those. It's very so special. So stay tuned. Yes. For that. Um, and two, you know, we just really briefly touched on uh, what Haley does, but Haley has a ridiculously, ridiculously interesting and inspiring uh, transformation story. So um, we're gonna link up to that uh, transformation story in another video that we'll post uh, over here shortly. Here. <laughs> you know, that floating bubble. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but today, today we have jars why do we have jars because like many women <laughs> we are on the go all the time and we don't have time to cook and it's frustrating because we try to eat healthy and the options are pretty scarce when you're on the road so you need something quick and convenient that's going to be also not messy because how many times mm -hmm. have you been like eating a salad in like a bowl <laughs> from like the drive through or something and it's like getting everywhere oh, i can't do it story of my life yeah i have lettuce all the time and I only bring one, you know, one outfit, hoping for the best, and I always end up getting food on myself. It's just like a uh, personal trait. So this is going to help you not do that. Exactly. So we're making... Where are they? Right here. We're making salad in mason jars. How cool is that? So, Steph is here and about a ton of things. I brought the goodies. I did bring some. <laughs> um, I get a question from you guys all the time asking what to do, especially if you're at work or if you're going to school, um, how to make these easy lunches that are still healthy. So yes, the type that we are doing today is um, we're going to make a Mexican style mason jar recipe. And this empty jar is going to become full of delicious, delicious, goodies. delicious food. Um, before we hop into it, do you want to talk about the ones that we have pre-made? Yeah, because you can do, it doesn't have to be salads. Um, and here we've got hummus and veggies. You can do celery and peanut butter is another one. <laughs> this is really cool because if you take the metal lid off, you can heat these up in the microwave. So all you have to do is add water or almond milk. And this is a pancake, protein pancake mixture. And I actually, people ask me all the time, how do you make protein pancakes? So like when you have friends who don't know how to do it and they don't have all the ingredients, you give them these. And like, what a great gift too, you know? Because uh, Thanksgiving, Christmas, like this is a great That's a housewarming gift. This is pumpkin? pumpkin. Oh, yeah. Just add a little pumpkin puree to it. That is so fall right there. Yes, seasonal. I love that. Oh, uh, yum. That looks so delicious. I, uh, I love this too. I always do like the little hummus and veggies and in the mason jar it just like you said it's so less messy. Less messy. Which is awesome. Yeah.
don't know which side's the prettiest. That one. Let's see That's that the one. prettiest side. Oh. Nice. So that was it. That was your mason jar recipe. Number one, numero uno. What did you think? What did you think? I think it's great. I think it's great. You could do this, you could do like an Asian style salad there. Oh, for your kids. Yes, yes, yes. Salad, I love sushi. That's something I like to do too. Like you kind of uh, took this Mexican dish and made it Asian. I also, you know, I like to think of, um, especially with grains, whole yeah. grains. You know, they're they're bland. They don't have a lot of flavor. So if you think about it in terms of uh, types of food, Mexican, make your brown rice Mexican by adding these things. Exactly. Make it uh, an Asian dish by adding edamame. You can also, you know, go Greek and add feta and cucumber and tomato and spinach. Um, tomato sauce. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's so much you can do and we're just like, our minds are kind of blown after these uh, mason jar recipes. So we're thinking that if you guys are interested in it, you know, let us know and we can do more recipes. Um, we're really easy mason jar things. As we were talking, you can have soups in there, you can cook eggs, you can do like the mug cakes put in the jar. All of your meals in there. <laughs> Seriously, you really could. Oh, smoothies too. Smoothies. What did oh. you were saying about the smoothie? Yeah, you can actually take your lid and drill a hole in it and stick a straw in there so that you have a drinkable cup. And if you get the, <laughs> if you can find little ones, they fit in your cup holders. Oh, do they? So like you know, you're driving and you don't have hands free for at least until you're at a red light and you can like <laughs> pick it up. <laughs> or you can do what I do and kind of just like lean over. <laughs> I'm not eating right now. <laughs> yeah. That's because you know these never fit. That's what I do. Sometimes I put my smoothies in these and they're, they're just awkward. But um, yeah, there's tons of things you can do with these. If you want the full recipe, I'm going to post it on my website, uh, stephendel.com. Um, we're also going to, of course, like we mentioned earlier, um, Haley's going to tell her story in an awesome Transformation Thursday video uh, that we'll be posting up soon. Make sure you check out Haley's website, May Movement. Uh, they're doing big stuff and you want to be part of it. Go grab some cool bracelets too. There's fall <laughs> colors. <laughs> We'll see you in a, another video soon. See you guys.